Today I wanted to talk about something that's been trending for a while. Survival videos, outdoor videos, you know, these videos where they um, <laughs> they go and make a shelter. You know, they, they go and make a log cabin off the grid, hot, hot tent camping, like this one, for example. This is a dugout. You know, they do this dugout right here. So they do this dugout. Oh, it just it just build. You just building the whole thing, digging it out, doing all this shit. You know, it's really nice. It's really nice. I like it. I like it. You know, and it just goes through all the stuff. And you have some of them. There's storms, and you you, you know you have a lot of different takes on this. That basically, it's like come up with the come up with an idea. Like coming up come up with something that people haven't seen. Like do an outdoor video in a way that people haven't seen before, but it, you know, like, like YouTube is, it just becomes populated with so many different people doing, you know, basically a lot of the same things. And, and, and it's like me, you know, like just people talking on camera and I'm making some video about survival videos. Um, <clears throat> but anyways, yeah, you got, you got a lot of strange, uh, versions of this. There's actually a channel where they build all these really weird buildings. Um, but, it, you know, it's, it's kind of funny because there's just inf like an infinite number of these fucking like ASMR like, type shit. Like this is like weird bamboo, like little treehouse shit right there. You know, there's just like all of these different ones. Oh, look, someone's caught with a snake. That's probably not. That's like total like. You know what I'm saying? It's just like this survival shit. And it's a way it's a way of life, you know? It's a it's a it's a thing, you know. It's it's going out there, getting in touch with with yourself and all this shit. And but you know, it's like whenever you make a video about it and you, and you you're you know trying to market this whole thing online, it's not, you know, I don't know. It's it, it's weird. It's like for me like doing comedy. I I would do comedy and it wasn't like I was trying to sell that to anybody until some people were like, hey, you should be a comedian. And I was like, yeah, I, I should probably try. And then I started trying and it's it's really hard. But, you know, it wasn't like I was trying to sell it. And, and now I kind of am. So whenever you look at this, you know, these people have they have a passion for this and then they just turn it into this. You know, it it's like it, it's everything. It's ev everything eventually turns into this capitalistic approach of i'm going to sell this and it's not just this it's everything you know it's gaming it's anything and um it's funny because i i really thought these videos were nice you know it's just they're they're pretty much they're, they're pretty much the same they just have you know people building log cabins and then they go and eat dinner and or you know they just it's just it's just this shit you know where they just show you building and it does take work to do this but that's the thing is you know, a lot of the a lot of the videos, it's like you respect it because people put in work or whatever, and like, yeah, hey, that's cool. Like, if someone just talks in a video, hey, that's not very interesting. You're not really putting in too much work, but it does take work to talk on camera. You know, present yourself in a certain way to where people are like, hey, I like listening to this person talk about interesting things or be smart enough to talk about things that people could potentially be interested in. But then, you know. You have people that they're not very interested in very many things because they don't really think about things too much or they, they don't really pay attention. They're not very smart. You know, they're, they're not. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> so so I and I did ended up making comedy videos that are just like the stupidest shit imaginable that you have no intellect in the video. You know, it's just like, does that mean that? Oh, you know, like I don't. And that's the thing is, I don't want to call people stupid like, oh, he's watching these videos because they're stupid. Like, I'm making stuff for stupid people. I don't really like to put it like that. It's just like some people's attention span is just that way. And sometimes you you can be smart or demand, like, a, a lot of substance, like, intellectually from a video. But it's almost like, well, what's almost the point of it? Sometimes it's like, well, you just, like, absorb all of this information. Sometimes I wonder if you really, you really get anywhere. But after watching these videos a lot, you know, you can learn a lot. And it's interesting to survive. Um, the, you know, they can obviously, you know, you can stage some stuff. Um, they, there's a lot of, it's, it's, it's weird because it's like, it's just like, if you think about normal construction videos, you know, 
um, normal construction videos where they just make like normal um, houses or whatever, you know what I'm saying? They're even throwing in some some hot chick in here or whatever, you know? In a, a sw you know, wow, you know what I'm saying? Wow, really trying to sell that. Um, it's pretty funny, actually. Oh, look at me showering in the wilderness. Ooh. Just make it a porno already. By the way, why don't they have pornos? That's pretty funny, actually. That's, that's pretty hilarious. I never thought, like, pornos are always in some sketchy fucking house or something, you know, where the lighting's always bad. Not that I know. I never watched porn. I've never, I don't even know what that is. What? What are we talking about? But yeah, you know, like normal, normal construction. Why don't we film that? Why isn't that interesting? Oh, it's in the city. You you see it every day when you when you pass by it, you know. But uh, I guess that's not very interesting. You know, just imagine if a construction worker, you know, I, I think you could make it popular. Like an ordinary construction worker make these construction videos, and then just make those popular. You know what I'm saying? Like just building a house. You know, I actually you probably could. Like if it was a cool house. Like, you could probably do it, but you're not there to film a video. If you're going to build a house, you're going to build a fucking house. You know, if you're out in the woods building a house, you're probably just building it for yourself, so you might as well film it, make some more money, you know? Um, does it, does it kind of take away from the spirit of it? Does it kind of take away from the whole idea? I like the whole idea. A lot of people like the idea of seclusion and just, you know, having a, having a little place. I like the idea of a dugout. There's, a, there's so many questions! I seen one where a guy like built him. He like dug out the snow and he make like this little. I don't know. It's pretty cool. They have like a lot of cool stuff that people do, but then you know it becomes oversaturated. There's like a million people doing it, and and then it takes money to do it too. You know because you you have to go out there in the forest. That costs money if you're gonna build a log cabin. You know, and then you you know you pretty much you know you gotta have money for that. But you know it's cool until you realize that maybe there's no point to it almost like it's it's really awesome like i would like to live out somewhere or whatever but the government you know keeps me here because i'm a slave to society and i can't build my own things like toothpaste and stuff so i guess i'm not gonna have a poetic winner out there in my own log cabin maybe i will maybe i will maybe one day i'll just get old and I'll be like i'm so successful on youtube i'm gonna go build a log cabin so maybe you should support this and maybe um i'll i'll, I'll show you my survival video oh yeah but i was trying to say they used to there used to be just a couple survival videos on tv until you know and, and that's what happens independent entertainment people will just oversaturate shit and you don't need a t a television network anymore and that's the whole conversation of, of tv networks you know fuck you tv networks you guys aren't better than us you guys aren't better than us wow wow that was out of that was hand out of hand well, that's all I got to say on this. Keep interesting.